I already tested computer viruses on my computer, and in today's video, I am going to be testing computer viruses against antiviruses again. Without any further hesitation, let's go ahead and get this video started. We are so back with this series. I'm excited to get this started. Before we get this video started, hit that like button. Let's get this video to 25,000 likes. All of my other videos have been obliterating that mark, so if you guys have been enjoying this series, please hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. I upload videos like this all the time. We have four antiviruses that we're going to test on this computer. We have Windows Defender, Total AV, Avira, and Surfshark. So if you haven't seen these videos before, it's really simple. I'm going to disable the antivirus, install a computer virus, and then I'm going to turn on the antivirus, scan the computer, and see if it could delete the virus off my computer. So first up, we have Windows Defender versus Bonziware. This is another version of Bonzi Buddy. I've been testing Bonzi Buddy on my channel for a really long time. Click the video that just appeared on the top right of the screen if you haven't seen me test Bonzi Buddy on my real PC. All the actual versions. So as you can see, the real-time protection is actually disabled on Windows Defender. That's the first step. Now we're going to go ahead and open up Bonziware. Run as administrator. Do you want to allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device? Bonziware.exe. Yes. There he is. Hello, I am Bonzi, and I am here to destroy your computer once again, but this time, it will be much more destructive than before. The first thing I am going to do is to encrypt all your shortcuts, photos, videos, documents, music, and more. Doesn't the encryption look great? There is no way to restore your files from now on, because they are lost now. Also, if you didn't know, I disabled Task Manager, Registry Editing Command Prompt, and other stuff to prevent you from deleting my cores or terminating me. I will do so much things such as Corrupting your registry, deleting your drivers, and corrupting your system files as well. Doesn't that sound great? It's the same thing! Draw something if you want. You have 30 seconds left to enjoy the last seconds using your computer. I have to draw something? You have 20 seconds left to oh, enjoy bro, the chill. last seconds using your computer. Chill! You have 10 seconds left to enjoy the last seconds using your computer. Oh my god. Time's up! The destruction of your computer is now activated. My work on this computer is now done. Goodbye, user. Just enjoy your brick computer and maybe try to fix it, but it will not be possible anyway. Well, anyway Goodbye. Okay, so I have to fix my computer. He disappears. I wrote, uh, subscribe, please. So this is, what the hell is this? Everything is dot Bonzi. This is a ransomware. Windows Defender dot Bonzi. Avira dot Bonzi. All my antiviruses have been bricked. What the hell is this? I can't even open up Bonzi again. My computer has been super bricked. We're gonna open up Defender and it's not opening. What the hell? Can I open up Total AV? Yes, I can. Stick around for Total AV because that's the next antivirus that I'm gonna use in this video. Windows Security. I can't even open up Windows Security. Security settings. Dude, what kind of... My computer is bricked. I can't even open up Google Chrome. That's messed up, bro. What do I do? That's a pretty cool version of Bonzi Buddy. It's, it, it reminds me of Bonzify, but it changed up the wording a little bit. But this one is a little bit more terrifying. Microsoft Edge. Break point has been reached. Terminate the program. There are currently no power options available. I can't even shut off my PC. Control, ALT, delete. That's messed up. I don't even have task manager. Oh my god, Bonziware absolutely cooked my PC. It looks like for Windows Defender versus Bonziware, Bonziware won. Bonzi strikes again. Well, I absolutely bricked my computer. I didn't clone my PC before running this virus, so since my computer was in this state, I couldn't clone it now because I'd just be cloning a cooked PC. I got stressed that I had to reinstall Windows from scratch, but before I tried to do any of that, I tried to use the second antivirus software to remove the damage that has been done to this computer. Waited almost 15 minutes for the scan to complete. The antivirus found all the viruses that the computer had on it, I clicked on remove selected viruses, changed the file extensions back to exe, and tried to run Defender. But it said this app can't run on your PC. I restarted the computer and my PC went into Windows recovery mode. I tried fixing the problem through there, but I had no success. So I guess I had to completely reinstall Windows and reinstall all the antiviruses on the PC so I can get started testing the next antivirus. So up next we have the Total AV versus the Horror Piggy virus. So with Total AV, as you can see, my real time protection is disabled on the computer. We're gonna go ahead and run the horror piggy virus. I don't even know what this is gonna look like. Whoa, whoa, restarting. This computer is restarting right now because we ran the horror piggy.exe virus. What's gonna happen? What's happening? Okay, crypto NWO, as if nothing even happened to my computer.
Oh my god. So there's a bunch of programs on here. Piggy, 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 piggy. It took out all my antiviruses off my home screen. But we're going to go ahead and we're opening up. Actually, we opened up Total AV Antivirus. We're going to enable Total Protection. There we go. Total Protection is enabled. We're going to do a quick scan for my antivirus. So as you can see, my computer is running a antivirus scanner right now. It's 5% complete. When this goes red, that means it found a computer virus. But it's still green. It hasn't found anything on my computer. Oh my god! What is this? We have a pig with another pig in the background. That's what it looks like. Still green. It hasn't found any viruses. What do you mean? Scan complete. Zero issues found. But it says threats blocked. Windows security VBS. That's not what we're looking for. So we're back onto antivirus scan. We're going to go ahead and run a full system scan. Let's see if this is going to fix my problem. Hopefully it does. I'm at 0% and it currently found a virus on the computer. Multiple threats blocked. So we're 1% complete. This is going to take a while. I'm getting out of here. So this was clearly going to take a lot of time. So I decided to leave the computer to do its thing while I went to go take a break. On my break, I went upstairs and I got myself a snack. I didn't really know if my computer was going to be okay or not. So I decided to have some grapes to take the edge off. After eating my grapes, I had some iced tea to wash them down. After my little snack break, the antivirus was still doing its scan. So I decided to kick back and watch two whole episodes of Drake and Josh. After the two episodes, I went back to my computer and the antivirus found threats on my computer and they were ready to be be addressed we're gonna go ahead and click stop on the antivirus all right so those are all the malwares that it found it found eight malwares i was starting to believe that the antivirus actually fixed my computer so i deleted all of the exe files that were made automatically from the virus deleted i think the virus is completely deleted off the computer and i changed my background back to normal oh my god and we were officially virus free on the computer all the computer viruses are off my computer so up next we have avira versus divix the divix virus i think that's how you say it i have avira security over here as you can see the real-time protection is turned off on the computer and i just wanted to clarify that avira antivirus is completely free and i also wanted to clarify that no antivirus in any of my videos, including this one, have been sponsored by me. There are zero biases to make this a completely fair comparison, you know? But yes, the real-time protection is off on the computer. I am now vulnerable to new threats. So now we're gonna go ahead and run the Divix virus. Run as administrator. Do you wanna allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device? Divix x64.exe, yes. Plain and simple. Run malware. Warning, this deletes physical drives, contains strong language, loud noises, and flashing colors. The creator is not responsible. Shout out to Pankoza for this one. Let's click yes. Last warning, really? This deletes physical drives and windows. We're gonna go ahead and click yes. Okay, the virus executed. That looks really cool, I'm not even gonna lie. This is what my computer actually looks like. This is exactly what I'm dealing with. Let me just, so I have to just drag this around so I can still see it. Oh dude, that's messed up. We have to make sure we execute the antivirus as soon as possible so it just doesn't destroy the computer. Let's hit turn on. So let's do a smart scan. Alright, it's currently scanning right now. Is it, is it scanning? Yeah, it is scanning. 18%, 20% complete. Who cares about the performance issues? Go on to the viruses! We have Avira Free Security versus the Divix virus. If this antivirus wins, that's crazy because it was free. Oh, it's scanning the viruses. Yalla Habibi, you can do this. Oh no. No way. No way. No way. Oh, it, it finished the viruses. It finished the viruses. It's currently scanning outdated apps. It got rid of the virus. This, I, I'm telling you, again, this is not sponsored. I'm just so hyped right now because this is a free antivirus. This is as free as Windows Defender. And this actually worked. That is crazy. And the virus is not here. What the hell? Yo, Avira for the win. Just waiting for the scan to complete. It checked for privacy issues, performance issues, viruses, outdated apps, and the network threats. That's interesting. That's actually really cool. It's scanning the network threats now. Do you know smart TVs can be hacked? 
virus free, five outdated apps. I don't know if I want to skip, let's do show details. Sorry for interrupting the video. I just want to quickly tell you that the video you're watching right now has zero sponsorships. If you're enjoying what you're watching, go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. That's all I really wanted to say. Let's go ahead and get back into the video. They got rid of the viruses, fix selected issues. There's no way it's that easy. So far, I'm loving this one. I'm actually loving, this is crazy, man. This one's so OP. It's so the Avira antivirus versus the Divix virus. Of your one. Up next, we have Surfshark versus the Metaverse virus. So Surfshark, and again, this is not sponsored, but they have a VPN, alternative ID, alerts, and whatever, whatever, whatever. We're not going through all that stuff. We're just going to go through the antivirus. The real-time protection is off, web protection is off, and that basically leads us to the next step. But we're going to go ahead and open up Metaverse.exe. Malicious file. This application may cause damage to your device. Sensitive personal data may also be at risk. Show more run anyway warning this program is a computer virus it may make your computer cannot work normally whether to run or not please don't maliciously open this program on other people blah 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 we're gonna hit yes this is the last warning do you want to really run after running your computer may not work normally yeah whatever let's do i mean it's working oh dear god so we have surfshark here I can't see anything. There it is. Oh dear god. So we have to go to the antivirus, go to the real-time protection. It's not working! Real-time protection on. Hell yeah. It's still running the antivirus. Alright. So this is what my computer is looking like right now. My computer looks like this. This is actually a really cool looking computer virus. Shout out to N17 Pro for making this computer virus. We're gonna hit quick scan. All right, Surfshark is currently being executed against this computer virus. Which one do you think is gonna win? Oh dear God. It's giving me false hope every time the virus stops for a second like that. That's so stressful. The scan is in progress. What? What? <laughs> no freaking way! So the computer virus is just... Wait, scan was complete. Oh my god, no way Surfshark just removed the computer virus. Bro, this is actually really cool. View quarantine, metaverse.exe, delete quarantine files, quarantine is empty. This is actually hype as hell, I like this antivirus. So Surfshark versus the metaverse virus, Surfshark won. That's awesome. The only way to solidify this test is if I restart my computer and my boot record, my MBR, is still there. If my computer doesn't boot, then I guess the computer virus beat the antivirus. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed, hopefully we get this. Oh no way, I think it worked. Crypto NWO, as if nothing even happened to the computer, I gotta give Surfshark the W. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I am gonna be ranking every single antivirus that I've tested in a video that's coming in the future, so subscribe to the channel if you guys wanna be notified for that video. Hit the like button and put on that notification bell. I love you guys, I will see you in the future. Actually, if you click the video that just appeared on the top of the screen, I know you'll enjoy this video because I hand-selected this video. But thank you so much, I'll see you in the future. Love ya.